Due to its geographical vantage where trade facilitation is concerned, Zambia was selected by the Common Market for Eastern and Southern Africa, COMESA, to be part of the five countries to pilot the SMS platform for reporting, monitoring and eliminating mechanisms of non-tariff barriers. The SMS platform is primarily meant to eliminate trade-related challenges that traders face on a day-to-day -day basis at border posts that range from cumbersome border procedures and unnecessary body searches. To implement this progressive trade initiative, strategic players such as the Southern Africa Cross-Border Traders Association was drafted into the monitoring committee to ensure successful implementation of the SMS platform. Of what good is a program if the targeted grouping do not know about it, it is from the aforementioned premise the Southern Africa Cross-Border Traders Association conducted awareness activities at Kasumbalesa border post in Chilabombwe on the Copper Belt. The objective of the initiative is to plug in the information gap on the NTBS and reporting procedures to cross-border traders, especially on women traders. To understand the SDR in facilitating cross-border trade amongst small cross-border traders, especially women traders, with low literacy levels. To establish the perception and views of cross-border traders on the introduction of NTBS reporting platform tools and implementation of the SDR between Zambia and Congo DRC to distribute IEC material on NTBS SMS reporting platform and STR to traders. Cross-border traders from Zambia and Congo DRC were equipped with knowledge on how the SMS platform works. Southern Africa Cross-Border Traders Association Secretary General Jacob Makamwe addressed the traders at Kasumbalesa on the SMS platform. <laughs> So nga mwamo na avantu Nava, nava kumana so Yino filofine Mufuile mwai pusana, nishi vaishi na kono Mufuile mwai shibofia Kufia kuchitama kwe wabu no wino So that nga mule pitapa boda Panya, notu kututumana Kwata bope ni taushi voku Limanishi na liove Imwe kuti mwai sa mwasenda information Kuliwa cross border Ukuli konseko munga basanga So na tutote na nga nishiva DC Makuisa mkwisa grace this particular occasion we are very much happy because this is very important and we need to push in so that the information about cross-border trade and how they should manage this particular business they should follow the regulations and the protocols and all the things that have been signed to guide and simplify the trade so the DC I'm just going to explain a little bit just for you to understand that the platform that was launched it is a platform that each and every trader must take an sms if they have challenges and the necessary roadblocks and the necessary body searches and more of the things that impede cross-border traders especially women cross-border traders so we are very happy to have you so that you are able to welcome us and to allow us to continue Tualaba muno mkasumbalesa, ukufumalelo, mailo, na pamande. Tuala kwa tama t-shirt ya ingeo ya isa, ya kwa ta information. So, wonse, ukwamba na ngulelo line, na mailo, na pamande. Mwakula mwona, tuakula pita mamake, tukula ndanama traders. So that mwishiwe, NTP, ipiri ulafinshi. Mwishiwe, simplified trade regime, ipiri ulafinshi. So that you must understand, nga mwlefo ukia kukongo, Ama document seo mlefu ayo kusenda. So, tuwalawo mbira pamo ukufikira pamande. Chilabombwe District Commissioner who officiated the launch says the platform is timely because it will ease trade for Zambian cross-border traders. Here as a happy DC to come you to officers because our government and our able leadership is excellence. Dr. Edgar Chagwalungu, we look at our traders as one of our income earners for the country. Therefore, in all the times, our government makes sure that we support our small-scale farmers, especially the women folk, who in most times, most cases, are found wanting by different people, different emotives. And I'm sure this the suggestion you brought to Chilabombwe, Vice Chairman General, Secretary General, 
it will go a long way for our traders. When they come here to sensitize traders, they don't segregate or choose only those who belong to CBTA. No. They have come for all small scale traders. CBTA, Cross Border Traders Association. It means even our community can come and learn from what they are doing here on December because we believe in one issue to support our small scale traders. No matter if from Congo, if it's under CBTA, Tanzania, Malawi, because we all fall under Comesa. <laughs> so if we like a Sumba Lesa, our traders, please don't miss this important sensation of our your, your traders. Don't miss learning how to communicate. They have given you a tow fee number, which you can just there and then SM S to the next office and your problem will be solved. Cross-border traders have welcomed the initiative, saying it will help to curb smuggling at Kasumbalesa. Kasumbalesa is the fifth highest revenue earner for Zambia behind border posts like Nakonde and Mwami. Therefore, the SMS platform is expected to increase trade volumes between Zambia and Congo DRC, thereby increasing revenue inflows.